Hello everyone, welcome back to Culture Cave. So sorry, it has been so long since I posted a video. There has been not many statues come through recently. Um, I've just been waiting so, so long for a few of them. Been doing a few upgrades here and there. Currently got construction going out in my apartment. So, so many things happening, but I am proud to be back and showing you one of my most anticipated statues for the year, which I just received in the mail today. And he is the Prime One Arkham Knight Nightwing. I've been looking forward to this statue since I pre-ordered it back in September. I'm so excited it's finally here, so I cannot wait to unbox him with you guys. Um, so, you know, without further ado, I've already taken the star of him out of the box, just to make it a little bit easy for me this time around. So, let's see how we go. Let's open this bad boy up. I've already got a spot for him right here, so I'll see if I can put him straight up next to everyone else for you. Alright, so let's go and find my trusty unboxing knife. Alright, here we go. Actually, I might put the camera down for you guys so you can actually see what I'm unboxing now. I'm hoping that he came all in one piece, so let's get this in the way. Looks like Customs might have already opened him, but and resealed him up, but we'll just see how we go. Ah, and that good old silk packaging from Prime One that I love so much. Okay, so I did get the exclusive, so he is number 33 out of 250. Looks fairly simple to put together. And we have the heads in here looking amazing. Alright, first thing, might as well get the base out. Alright, amazing base. Look at all the detail in that eagle skull. Alright. Let's do a bit of a, a Batman logo right there. And as I'm guessing the ledge that he stands on. Let's get over to the side. Pretty sure I've got workmen looking at me thinking, what the hell is this guy doing right now? <laughs> Alright, next thing to come out is his first arm. That's what I see. Alright, so if you can kind of get a look at that. Really, really solid. And that paint up is amazing. Stitching looks great. There's a bit of a blue tinge to the camera, I apologize for that. But the workmen have put a blue cellophane on my window, so can't do much about that unfortunately guys. But we'll just see how we go. Alright, so I'll have a look at all three heads. They actually all come very nicely packaged. They're in their own individual individual little spots here. So, I'll put that up to the side and let's grab a look. Oh, wow, okay. That is amazing. Heavy, very, very heavy, just like most Prime ones. 
a few scratches on there but I believe that's intentional just to give it that kind of battle worn look I hope <laughs> so a few bits of battle worn scuff I'm not too fussed about that that is fine it just kind of looks a little bit more weathered I don't know if you can kind of see it to here and on the blue chest piece as well if you guys have it looking any different let me know Damn, that is one impressive looking piece. There's a few notches on the belt there. I'll get a bit of a zoom in on that later. Okay, so just quickly try and put him down. Okay, and let's have a look which one this is. This one looks like it's there. Yep. Okay, there we go. Second hand. I'm guessing you have to put in the additional Eskrima stick there. But once again, paint detail, very, very good. A few paint lines I can see on there, but again, not too fast with that. Turn the camera back. As you can, guys can probably see, I have updated my display a little bit and added a few extra pieces here and there. Okay, so what I might actually do is set him down. Put the base up first. Alright, so let's get a closer look before we put on the head. Can't forget about the all important piping. You do get just a bit of piping there. Alright, the important part, the heads. Alright, so let's go through it. Arkham Knight heads first. So we have normal looking head sculpt here. Again, it looks incredible. 
The detail on this is absolutely insane. Love the edgy haircut they gave him. I know a lot of people aren't a fan of the new Nightwing mask that they gave him for Arkham Knight. I personally don't mind it. I don't mind the fact that it goes down all the way to his face. Right, let's just put the first one on. Right, it's in there. Alright, I'll show you guys the second one. I think I'm going to display him with this head just because the smirk is more of a Nightwing characteristic. I mean, the hairline on here is insane. And finally, oh, it's very, very low in the packaging. That's the sure. job. 